Hey folks, ET here, and today I'm going to show you real quick in under two minutes how to use multiple points of confluence from the trading platform to execute trades a little easier and with a little bit more confidence. So the first thing I want to point out is I always have the largest dark pool level marked on my chart. So as we're looking at right here, 412.78 as of Friday was our largest dark pool level at 28.73 billion. I think it's changed a little bit since then, but that is where it is at now. Point number two, I want to look at price above or price below of where ODT EGEX is pulling. Okay, so at this point in the day when we were around here, we started to see negative levels at 412 and 412 50, 412.50, which would get us pretty close to this point, right, of our biggest dark pool if it happened to reject there. So the third thing, the third point of confluence is does MNF point in the same direction? Do we have a nice green MNF that says price should pull up because ODT GEX says so? There's a large dark pool right there, so money likes to stay around where it already is, right? There's a lot of money there, so price could reach it again. And does MNF point in the same direction? Those are the three points of confluence that I try to use uh, at all times, whether I'm long or I am short. An inverse of all of this, if we had ODT GEX, pulling down we were we were way above this dark pool in this price area here around 416 and we had a, gr a red MNF one could surmise that price might move down towards that 41278 again that is all for now I hope this helps in using the data points in the trading platform for confluence everybody have a good weekend